From WFHB, this is the local news brief for Tuesday, October 6th. I'm Jake Jacobson. 990 new cases of COVID-19 were reported in Indiana on Monday, according to the Indiana State Department of Health. There were 30 new reported deaths. Locally, Monroe County saw 24 new confirmed cases yesterday. Keep in mind, Indiana University releases its COVID test results on Wednesdays. Lawrence County reported five new cases, while Brown County reported one. The City of Bloomington will be hosting its third public meeting discussing the redevelopment of the old IU Health Hospital site tonight. The city bought the 24-acre site in 2018, while construction of the new IU Health campus was beginning on State Road 46. Attendees will be able to participate in discussions on three topics about the refined plan, access plus connections, open space, and land use plus neighborhood character. Tonight's meeting will serve as another opportunity for community feedback. Another public meeting is planned for December, where a finalized plan will be presented. The forum will be live streamed starting at 6 p.m. tonight on the City of Bloomington's Facebook page and on catstv.net. Early voting has begun in Indiana. The deadline to register for voting has passed, but Hoosiers can still request a mail-in ballot until October 22nd. Bloomington residents can find more information on absentee voting and early voting locations and times at MonroeCountyVoters.us. Brown County residents can find voting resources online at BrownCountyLibrary.info slash voting resources. Lawrence County residents can find this information at LawrenceCounty.in.gov slash government slash voter dash registration. That's all for your local news brief. From WFHB, I'm Jake Jacobson.